Hello my soccer universe. If you're watching my channel, you know what my favorite type of video is. Unpacking jerseys, growing the collection. It's just the best part of it all. I really, really gotta say. Now, um, I'm not sure if I'm getting a lot of jerseys in April. I jerseys that I have ordered <laughs> already in March at, at, at times and, and so, but now it's the time that they're coming in. So I don't know in what sequence I'm gonna do this. I know that this package here, I I have the French background up. I'm wearing a France jer a jersey. Idris helped me with getting two jerseys that I have been really looking for for quite a while. One is a national team jersey and one is a club jersey, which I'm getting as a reward for, you know, finishing finally a big project at work and receiving a bonus for that as well. But what I want to show you is, of course, the national team jersey, because it fits with the background back there, like the last one that I showed you. And let's see if this is the one that posts first or not. Now, uh, this one is one that I have been uh, looking after for quite a while and regret not getting it when it was available. On the other side, it is, was a time when I was not so freely buying jerseys as I am currently because I hadn't figured out yet that, you know, if you buy a second hand, you sometimes can get really, really good deals. Maybe haven't figured out or it wasn't really available at that moment. And I think it was uh, that it resent me. Yeah, here's his website. If he orders, he wants to have half a shirt. It was a French website, I think. If he orders one shirt and I order this shirt, then uh, he can get the shirt. Uh, then we can get free shipping, which of course is a really, really, really nice deal. And so that's the shirt that I'm gonna show you now first because it it's an absolute banger. It is one that will so perfectly go for the World Cup. It also um, you can see it already nicely blue back. It also goes really, really uh, into what I've been looking forward to for this particular national team. The only downside is that it's a double XL, but I think I am fine with that because this is a jersey. I think, did I pay 35 for, 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 for it? I have never seen the jersey on sale for a reasonable price. I think for a very short while I have seen it on classic football shirts, but it always sold for at least 80 or so. So I am very, very pleased to get this shirt. Oh, this is, this is such a beauty. Get this shirt for a really reasonable price, and even if it's a bit too large. Yeah. Let me show you. And the color that I have, most of the jerseys that I've I'm have been all ordering have have this color. You will see a lot of blue jerseys. I'm talking, of course, the Netherlands. 2014-15 away jersey. I have the home jersey, which is hanging right behind the cam camera. Now I have the away jersey. I always wanted to have a blue Netherlands jersey with a touch of orange. Uh, and honestly, given the wonderful crest, and you have to see how gorgeously well this is done. It's only my second jersey with this crest. Uh, it is absolutely gorgeous how well this is done. Um, this is an absolute gorgeous jersey, an absolutely gorgeous jersey. I mean, for me, it was always either it's the 96, 97 one or 97 one or the 98 one, because all the others that were blue and orange never really quite did it for me. And of course, now the only thing that's missing for me for my Dutch collection is a white one, although there are two versions. I mean, there's a white with kind of the Dutch flag, 2006, 2013, it would be nice, or the the 15 away jersey which was white also with the orange lion man is this a beautiful jersey i mean i know when it came out um it was clear that uh, the geometrical pattern there is of course a reference to the famous pattern that they won the euros in and actually actually the home jersey was initially ru rumored to have the same pattern in in there of course nike cannot oops, nike cannot reproduce that one because they don't have the cop copyright so they went a little bit for it um, that the gradient then goes to into this darker blue is probably something that you have to get used to. But the moment the Dutch uh, beat Spain in that one, 5-1, I think they played in that jersey also against Australia and then in the third place match against Brazil, it became 
an instant classic. And that they fell then completely apart after that World War Cup is an entirely di different story, but it doesn't decrease the allure of this beautiful, beautiful shirt. And I have to say, blue with the orange is just a gorgeous combination. I couldn't be more happier to have this one. Yes, this jersey is huge. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a, a double XL, but it's also a jersey that you don't get a lot and not for that price. And that price was for me the where I said, okay, I will not get a orange and blue Dutch jersey that I like for cheaper. So that's why I went double XL. Let me know what you think about this one. I am absolutely floored. I mean, um, I have the white card. I mean, I look at it daily. But this lion crest is so beautifully done. I would argue, I mean, I love what they did for the French national team. Going from this one to the old style um, rooster crest. But the way that the lion is done with all, and I think here the light actually, with all the detailing in there, this is just so gorgeous. So yeah, I guess I have to get a few more. I have... Uh, I love the orange, the orange line. I mean, the, the white with orange is nice. And maybe, you know, if there's maybe a, a, a line in black, that would be nice to have as well. Let's see what the World Cup jersey will bring. I absolutely love this one. This, I want the Netherlands to stay with this line forever. Look at it. Look at it. It's gorgeous. Any case, let me know what you think about this jersey. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. And I will talk to you soon. Bye. I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day.